Hello, hello, welcome back to another anime art video. My name is Dennis and I'm a beginner artist and in today's video I'm going to be drawing I don't want to say Ichigo Kurosaki, but I kind of do because the body belongs to someone new <laughs> Anyways, um, I will say this I what I have a problem with this is another inconsistency problem uh, with the show what I have a problem with is you have somebody like Cone, right, who when he was first introduced was able to fight against uh, Soul Reaper Ichigo. But you have that same Cone in these episodes running from hollows as if like they actually can do anything to him. If you can fight against Ichigo Kudasaki, you can fight against hollows it's so weird that he like the he acts the way he does when he's in ichigo's body as if he doesn't know how to fight right like he he should know how to fight like ichigo i'm pretty sure ichigo himself in his own body he fights with his legs more than anything right so his legs should be pretty powerful on top of that uh cone is a uh enhanced uh leg human or has an enhanced legs uh model um model anyway yeah so he has he has enhanced legs but for some reason he refuses to use them to fight against opponents. For some reason, it took him getting an enhancement uh, bomb type thing attached to his uh, uh, inside of his suit in order to allow him to do any combat. But you have Totsky, somebody who is actually only human and who has only practiced martial arts and who has only recently been able to actually fight against a hollow you have her over here fighting against a bunch of hollows but you have cone who was literally built as a human to fight not wanting to fight <laughs> i think i think it's weird it's really weird it's like really inconsistent in uh terms of like overall story you can't like that's the equivalent of like the other mod souls, the other three, that when they get put back into their body, like they act as if they can't use their powers to like their fullest extent and like they're like limited in what they're able to do, but they were able to do so much when they were fighting against somebody like Ichigo. Like, do they just love to say that, hey, Ichigo is weak against people that uh, aren't soul reapers, but if you put him up against a soul reaper, best believe that he'll actually uh, go to work like it's it's weird it's like you're not giving you like you're not making your character look good at all okay you're not you're not doing your character any solids you can make an enemy look like they're opposing uh and like like really dangerous and i understand that anime does that by having the uh the character beat up on a character that we know is strong so we know how strong ichigo is we're like oh ichigo was able to beat kenpachi ichigo was able to beat um uh what's his uh uh byakuya kuchiki he was able to beat um Rinji. he was able to beat bald guy i forget what his name is he was able to beat all those guys in the same day so we know how strong Ichigo is. So then when you introduce a new character, you're like, okay, so they're fighting Ichigo. So this should be cake. Wait, why is Ichigo losing? Wait, okay, Ichigo lost. All right. So why? Wait, Ichigo is going back in for seconds. Okay, Ichigo. Okay, Ichigo wins now. Huh? You know what I'm saying? Like, just make it make sense from the beginning. Like, just have the, the character assert their dominance on a character that is almost equal in strength to ichigo you can have a, a an enemy fight against Uryu or chad that'd be fine okay you can have that i know that those do two don't come close to ichigo in power but you can still have them fight them in a significant like fashion to the point where they just beat them outright like just like molly -wop them really easily and then we're left to an interpretation about how strong they are rather than 
having them like you know struggle to fight one of those two which would obviously be like oh if they're struggling to fight him then they can't beat ichigo you know like just just a little bit of, uh just a little bit of consistency would actually work wonders but let's get into this I am finished with this picture of Cone inside of Ichigo's body. I must say, I must say this. So we have, uh, we have Udahara able to 
basically alter clothes to specifically do different things. Why don't he do that more often? <laughs> the thing that I point out is Don Kinoji. Uryu says that Don Kinoji's mask was able to enhance, I think, like, I don't remember if he said his spiritual pressure output or something like that. But he said something along those lines. So why are these things that enhance, like, like output and stuff like that not used by other people? Like, for instance, somebody like Chad, maybe, you know, because Chad literally he can use physical enhancement uh enhancements like you can give him like some sneakers that'll do something extra right like you can do that same with Odahime. i know she has her which we'll call it but you, like you like you're limiting them to their own devices when you can assist them like they are human they're not ichigo okay they're like ichigo is a soul reaper it's different it's very different but that's it for this video. If you liked it, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you did. Let me know what I can do in the comment section so I'll make it better for you to watch next time. The glove is off. Peace, love. Thanks for watching.